Question 20 is about stem and leaf diagrams. And it gives you this in the question. The stem and leaf diagram shows some information about the speeds of 25 cars. And this is the stem here, and these are the leaves. Now you need to check the key. Two, line nine, this line here is this line over here. Two, line nine means 29 miles per hour. Party. How many of the 25 cars had a speed of more than 50 miles per hour? So let's just look at the numbers in the table. First one, 2 line 9, that means 29 from the, tip, from the key that's given. This one here, 3 line 1 is 31, 3 line 3 is 33 and so on. Now we want more than 50 miles per hour. So if I look here, we've got 51, so that's 1. 52, 54, 55, 56 and 60. So the question says how many of the 25 cars had a speed of more than 50 miles per hour. There is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. That's the answer. Now the next question uh, asks to find the median. Now when you find the median, the median is the middle number when the numbers are in order. Now in this table here, the stem and leaf diagram here, this is already an ordered stem and leaf diagram. So you don't need to order them. These are already in order. There's a few different ways of uh, finding the median, but I'm just going to choose one method. In the question, it says that there's 25 cars. Now the medianth number, to find the medianth number, what you do is add one to these 25 here. So the medianth number equals 25 add 1 divided by 2. So 25 add 1 is 26 and half it is the 13th number. Now let's go back to the table and try and find the 13th number. Now remember you start from the beginning of the leaves and work out over. So this is the 13th number. 1 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. So that number is a 4, but remember you need to look back at the stem. So that is not 4, it is 44. So the median, median equals 44. Okay, part C. Work out the range of the speeds. The range is the biggest number minus the smallest number. So from the table, the biggest number is 60 and the smallest number is 29. So the range is 60 minus 29. Okay? Now, looking at this, it's quite an easy subtraction. 29 add 1 is 30 and add another 30 is 60. So it is 31.